my polished shape pipe. Fully welded flanges. Very nice. Hardware. Welds in the flange all the way around. Nice and polished. Got some supports here too. That's nice. Right. Oh man. <laughs> oh yeah, see there's your your bung right there for the AFR. Oh yeah. Nice pipes, the baffling down in there. Also polished on the inside. Yeah, is it real? Oh yeah, polished all the way through. Excellent. Wow. Very nice. Now oh, it's got fingerprints all over. <laughs> <laughs> Good stuff. All right. <laughs> so we're making a comparison here with the A1 exhaust. And they're both stainless steel. The welds on the A1 are not the prettiest compared to the welds on the MOF exhaust. Those are different models, of course. Uh, but you can tell, I mean, A1 comes with uh, welds that are not treated and not welded fully. The flange is not deeper completely. Yep. And the, the pipe connection is uh, it's a piping pipe, slip through versus the flange here. And obviously one is fully polished, mirror finish, and the other one not just the 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 resonator here yeah the installation is straightforward the muff exhaust come with all the necessary hardware and it's pretty simple uh, something a, a person on, on their own can can install that in 15 minutes Main reason Curtis decided to upgrade from the A1 to the MAF exhaust was that he thought his exhaust was way too loud. But we also noticed that the, the MAF exhaust is not in contact with the, the, the body of the vehicle, while the A1 it's very, very close and in some places it is touching. <laughs> Yeah.